You're not going to believe it. We're here at the fifth anniversary of the Venture Center. I was here four years ago for the first anniversary, and, and yes. Amy invited me back. Amy, congratulations on five years of the Venture Center. Thank you. What are you most excited about tonight? I am excited about the network that's emerged over the last five years. Started out as about, you know, 20 or so people. Now we're hundreds and hundreds strong. Now I saw some statistics in the book you're handing out tonight about how many entrepreneurs you've actually helped in the area. What is that number? That number is over a thousand people have gone through our wow. EC training class and more than 200 businesses have launched as a result. That's unbelievable. I think that's more than the federal government has really helped during this crisis. What do you <laughs> I think? think? I, okay. <laughs> all right, we'll visit around some other people, all right? Yes. Amy, this is a great event. Thanks Thank for having me. We're expecting a lot of people tonight because a lot of people during this recession are very excited because, I don't know if you can see it, because they're excited about the revolution. The revolution that the entrepreneurs are going to bring. No one's coming to help us. This is the place where most people want to make their first stop tonight, right? Yes, definitely here. Because what's here? Great Alcohol. wine. Alcohol, um, right? Great faces and people, personalities. <laughs> because what I heard is that the speaker for tonight actually sounds better if you're drunk. It's true. Probably. It's true. Yeah, that's, true what that's what I've always been told. That's what I've always been told. So. Would you like a Miller or White? Uh, no, I'm, I, I'm good. He's the speaker. I, I'm a good. And what's the food tonight? I have no idea. We have a little bit of everything. You have no idea. A little I, bit I of know everything. We have some pasta. You have pasta. Asian delicious there. desserts wow. over there. Yeah. Unbelievable. Sushi, that looks sushi. Sushi. That sounds great. Real international flair yeah, up here in uh, Appleton, huh? That's right. That sounds fantastic. Nothing but the best. All right, let's drink up. Mike, Mike, oh, your bank you? is is the reception sponsor tonight. When all other banks in this country have really abandoned small business, why have you stuck with them? Well, Barry, we're a part of, we're about the community. That's what community banks are. First National Bank, Fox Valley, has been part of the community for over 120 years wow. now. And I mean, uh, we didn't make loans in outlying areas and do all those kind of things. We focus on the Fox Valley, and I think that's what we do best. That's great. And I have to tell you, as I said at lunch, if it wasn't community banks, nobody would be lending anything to small businesses. So thank you. Well, that's awesome, Barry. I appreciate it. I'm Brian Schock. I'm with Who Hot Mongolian Grill. And uh, hoo hot, <laughs> hoo hot. That's right. How, How hot, hoo hot. How hot, hoo hot. So, so I'm here today to kind of celebrate just entrepreneurship in general. Just, just the freedom of uh, being able to get out there, start your own business, uh, make a run at it. So that's uh, that's why I'm here in a great program. Great program. And, and then either succeed or fail. Oh, I, well, and then try again. Fail. Hopefully fail. Yeah. Hopefully if it, succeed. If, if at first you don't succeed, <laughs> destroy all the evidence that you at least tried. So that's right. <laughs> and, and try again. All right. Sounds good. And Mark, what about you? I am with uh, Groucher.com and I like being part of an entrepreneurial think tank. So that's really what I want to find out also is what will Brian do wrong so ah. I don't need to repeat it. <laughs> and then that way if I go down, we can go down together on it and burn all the evidence or whatever, but I don't plan on failing. So, so if we can't learn from our own mistakes, at least we can learn from other people's, right? Yeah, that's right, that's right. right. <laughs> and mark them down and never repeat them. And I'm a part of uh, Stella Blue Web Design. And about uh, four years ago, we, uh, me and my partners took the course at eSeed. And after that, we, uh, our business really started to improve. And uh, basically, we've been doing successful ever since. So we want to come back and support the program and support the people that this all you know, entails. And uh, basically go from there. So. so you're one of the success stories. Yes, yes, exactly. So you have your whole business life to thank the Venture Center. Yes, exactly. Right, that's always good to hear. It's always good to see. <laughs> if you're ever wondering what a success story looks like, this is what a success story looks like. He's got a beer in his hand, right? Now, tonight, they're also having a special raffle. And here, Lewis, Lewis, you're hard at work, right? Because you're going to win one of these, correct? Be at, least, at least two. At least two, because guess what? Someone's got to win, right? And you know who it should be? It should be you, Lewis. And here are some of the prizes. And of course, we're up here in Appleton near Green Bay, Wisconsin. What's the prize? Of course, an autographed picture, Aaron Rodgers. Couldn't get any better Aaron, than that. Why'd you come tonight? <laughs> to make me sure that this is really what I want to do and if I really can jump into this and you're going to inspire me to do that. So there's still a chance that I can talk you out of starting your own business? No. There's not. I see. You have resilience. Yeah, I came to support Fox Valley Technical College Venture Center in their efforts to raise awareness and the scholarships. And, and why is why do you think that the Fox Valley Venture Center is so important to this area? Because it stimulates growth for our business community. Fantastic. All right, Monica, and tell us just a second about your business. 
uh, Landmark Staffing. We're a regional staffing company that employs between 800 and 1,000 employees every year. My name is Sue Leonard. I own Leonard's Designs, which I make gourmet cookies. And they're delicious, by the just way. They're just fantastic. And the reason why I came, if I would not have come, Amy Peach would have called me up and yelled at me. And would have hauled you out of your house and brought you down, right? Yes, she would have, go. definitely. So you are the mother part of the mother-daughter combination of Autumn Hill Creative. Why did you come to the Venture Center tonight? Well, um, I'm a, a uh, eSeed graduate uh, six years ago, and uh, since then we've been growing our business, and tonight I've been part of the planning team for the last year, and tonight is the culmination of all our efforts, and I'm here volunteering and, and helping make sure the event goes smoothly. So, so you are one of the eSeed success stories? Yes. That's amazing. So again, another look at what a success story here really looks Talk like. about why people are here tonight. Let's face it, this is the real reason why people are here. <laughs> no. Oh my God, look at those little hot dogs and I stuff. I gave you my reason. I know, a little hot dogs, we got some buns, we got some meat. I haven't eaten all day for this. Wow, you, you know, day. because entrepreneurs really have no money to eat, right? Well, so they well, gotta come no to events time. like that this. No time. no time. I can't believe Al is here. Hey, Al, Gary Maltz, how are you, buddy? I'm good, so why'd you come tonight? I came to see you. <laughs> yeah. Well, why else would I come?